so, so, so important. And yet so many actors aren't being trained how to be in their stillness without it being stagnant. And I think the work that you're doing as Thomas, you know, not only the depth and the layering and the richness that you're bringing to him, but it's your stillness. That scene yeah. with you and Sam, where he's saying the most, uh, or, or the scariest thing is the unknown. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right? Ooh, I'm getting, I'm getting goosebumps right now. Just thinking about it. I rewound it several times. I want to, I want to show it because you, you could have gone towards an emotion, but instead mm -hmm. you went for a truth of the cover, I think. Yeah. And you said and you would feel that way if you hadn't had a whip. Yep. Your back. Yeah, that can't bring up emotions in you this late after it happened when you were younger and you have to cope, you have to get through life. We all do different things. There's another line I tell Sam or Shay's care, you know, I tell him laughing through him is how you get through him. You know, like tough times. Like we all have coping, we all mask things. Every day you're, you know, you're walking around and you might have had some bad news happen and you see one of your buddies, hey, how's it going, man? Oh yeah, it's it's cool. It's good. Going good. Going good. No, you're not. But you're 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 covering it. You're not. Oh, I'm so glad you asked. Right? Oh, yeah. We're not. Do we don't we don't do that. We we we'd be a sh we'd be done. We'd be walking around like woe is me. We can't. Why even get out of bed if that's your energy? Yeah. We we mask everything. And Thomas, especially of all the people in this series, in the 1800s, being a black man, like for him to have his attitude and his outlook and his hope, his, you know, the humanity and the soul of, you know, I hope these kids, you know, one of these kids has a kid and that kid does something that changes the world. Like that's how he looked at things. He's seen a better day where he's free now, free-ish, but he's seen it and it can, it can only get better. So that's how he goes through life, looking at the positives and not looking at the hole in the donut, but looking at the donut. But just still him telling you something about his past, he can still tell you and feel it. He's just not going to live in it and just, you know, there's another line that Thomas tells Shay. He says, uh, nightmare, you, you know, I've never seen you not sleep. Like, I don't understand it. Right. And Thomas says, the way I grew up, things I've seen, you know, we didn't, I wasn't worried about nightmares. You know, I, we went to sleep to escape them. And a few seconds later, he's like, I made some coffee. You know, like it's it's not what was me, you know, you know, I had a hard life. It's hey man, I made some coffee. We gotta get going. Morning right. started. We got we got work to do. Trusting the underneath and playing the cover. Yeah. Oh, and that just is such a pureness. I mean, not to geek out, but even the way you drank your coffee. I've seen you drink before. You don't drink like that. You know, you yeah. drink with your teeth. Like, is that is that something you've planned out? Is that something you've worked on or has it come out as your film? I'm learning so much from Thomas, like all his mannerisms and things that he does is not, that's not me. Mm. It's him. And it's the work I put into him. It's how he walks. He has this, this, not a limp, but he has like this little hitch in his giddy up that he walks like the physicality and the physicality is one of the hardest things for an actor to lose, um, trying to create a character because your physicality, that's what you've been doing your whole life. Right. You do things with your physicality that you don't even realize you're doing, but that's what your body knows and you're, you know, that's what it is. But when you put the work into it, little things, and when you're riding a horse, certain things come up. I've never ridden a horse, but riding it now, you know, it's, that's Thomas's physicality. And all the way from how he drinks to how he processes, he has a thing where he, he kind of chews on his inside of his, his, you know, just little things that just came up when I'm rehearsing, I'm like, I like that. I'm gonna keep mm -hmm. that. That's something different. That's 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 him. Yeah, it was so interesting. Immediately, you walk on camera, and you're you're. I mean, I did yoga next to you. Not that you knew that, because if you were too close, I'd have to move away. Because <laughs> yoga practice is pretty phenomenal. You know, it's <laughs> like I said, I tell people like angels sing, or or there's like a a, a beautiful something that happens, and my yoga practice is is not that. I don't know about that, yeah. but thank you. <laughs> no, it's true. A uh, little angel singing. Um, but you, you, as a former athlete, as someone who 
take such incredible care with with your instrument seeing sort of how you you didn't collapse you just shifted whether it was in your hips the horseback riding because that'll change you talk about yeah. being sore in a different way right you muscles know, right. we never knew even existed like all right that's there that's something new <laughs> but you just you you embodied him in a way that again it's like oh that's not that's not the guy who walked into yoga that's not the guy who walked in for coaching that's that's a totally different version which is yeah. freaking cool yeah you you bring some of who you are to the character in the beginning and the more you learn about the character the more the character is teaching you mm -hmm. you as the actor starts falling aside and the character you're still in there but it's more him than you <laughs> 